so today we are going to try out Allegiant. Um, we normally fly Frontier, we have to go out past, but something came up and we need to get to Myrtle Beach. So we're going to check out Allegiant today and see how they do. So we just thought we'd give you guys a review or a comparison to let you know which one we think is best, Allegiant or Frontier. Yep, so we'll do a comparison video today, uh, Frontier versus Allegiant. All right. So let's go check it out. Let's go. Okay, so we made it through security. It was a pretty easy process. The difference that we've seen so far between Allegiant and Frontier is that Frontier, we fly out of the big airport and Allegiant flies out of the small airport where we're at in the St. Louis area. And so it was much easier, simpler to get dropped off and get through the checkpoints and get up to the flight. So um, we got through security in like three minutes. Yeah, there, there's nobody here. So. Yeah. It's very, very easy. So far, Legion, very, very easy. Small airport, get through the checkpoints easily, and we're ready to go. We're already here at the gate and ready. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. So these are my new friends I met on the airplane. Say hi, guys. And we have determined this was a really good flight. It was. It was. All right. Very smooth. Very smooth. All right. We'll see you guys later. All right. We just got off the plane, landed here in Myrtle Beach. Uh, everything was on time. No delays. Uh, still no snacks or drinks or anything. You got to pay for those. But it was okay. I think the aisles were a little bit bigger. The seats were comfortable. But uh, we made it. Uh, biggest part, no delays. So we got here on time. All right, let's go. Hey guys, so we are finishing up our vacation or we are finished with our vacation? Yeah, unfortunately. Unfortunately. And we are at the airport in Myrtle Beach and we are headed back to the Midwest. Yep, heading back home now. So our flight <laughs> is delayed, yeah. but you cannot blame it on Allegiant. Yeah. I think it's weather related. We, it is weather. We got a, a warning when we got here that there's a tornado watch. Yep, so there was a tornado watch. Uh, so I believe that's why we have a delay right now. Yeah. So we'll get home yeah. eventually. Yeah, so far so good. So. Although we could stay. <laughs> It'd be nice to stay. If they give us an option, we're thinking about it, but we got to get back to work, so probably not. Right. So, all right. Bye. Bye. All right, thanks everyone for watching our video. Um, my take is that the Allegiant airline flight was better than the Frontier flight. Andy? You, I, I thought it was good. I think it, it seemed like that the aisles were bigger. I don't know if they really were, but it seemed like the aisles were bigger. I thought there was more leg room, Maybe. but the one thing that really, really stood out, uh -huh. out to me is that the stewardesses were so nice <laughs> and so funny. There was one named Pauline on the way back who just kept cracking jokes, and yeah. she was awesome. Yeah, she was funny. I mean, they said they were so nice, but just like the Frontier flights, you don't get any mm -hmm. snacks or free stuff, so you don't see them too often because you still have to pay for your soda, your peanuts, whatever you want to get. You don't get anything for free on this flight either. And as Andy says, no, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> nothing, nothing free. So uh, and we, we used our bags same bags that we use for Frontier so you can watch that video worked perfect so we didn't have to pay for any extra bags um, the airport we went to we left from uh, Belleville Airport and super easy I think we were through uh, the TSA the checkpoint in less than three minutes yeah there was nobody fast. there so we got there got right to our gate um, so very very fast so my review on the Allegiant flight I'm gonna give them a thumbs up well let's see I, uh, I think I'll give it a thumbs up to you <laughs> that's two thumbs up uh, but the comparison, we're here to compare Frontier to Allegiant. So both they both get you there. Uh, we didn't have any delays. The only delay we had was a weather delay. There was a tornado warning on our way back, so that delayed it. But, um, but that wasn't their fault. That's yeah. the so, weather's so fault. So Allegiant didn't have really any delays where our Frontiers had a couple delays here and there. Um, we would have flown Frontier to get there um, with our Go Wild Pass, but you have to fly all the way to Denver just to get to Myrtle Beach. So... You fly halfway across the country. And we're in the country. middle of the country, so yeah. being from the Midwest, we're not going to fly all the way to Denver to get yeah. back I, to the I think it would have taken coast. 16 hours, too, it said. So, yeah. But anyway, so we got it. And Allegiant is one of those other cheap airlines, so it didn't cost too much. Mm -hmm. yeah. Anything else? Uh, no. 
All right. So make sure you like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next video. All right. See you later. Bye, guys.